you don't have anything other than room room? It seems right, a bad idea. Let us do. They had a PSP? I never had a PSP. I don't feel bad. I don't feel bad. Alright. <clears throat> sure the guy that's creeping back here is not going to be able to help me out. Man, the <laughs> texture on that torch. I know, isn't it amazing? Look at the texture of the wall. Or anything, really. Looks like, like it's hellfire. It's nighttime, fire. like Bruma. Okay, Bruma's really pretty in the daytime because, uh... My favorite because they thing added, a grand, shit, but... added a bunch of shit. Added a bunch of Really? You like the way what they did with Skin Grid? I don't know. Uh, Bruma's my favorite town, and they really did Bruma a lot of justice by adding all these girls. It really looks like a Nordic really town. Looks like, like, I don't know. They added a lot of clutter. Afternoon. There's all these little pathways, because everyone knows that no one walks the pathways in this fucking, in this city. Everyone jumps from one roof to the next. That's what you do in Bruma. And what did they do? They added all these little freaking, like things on top of the roofs to make it so that you can just jump wherever you want for the most part. There's even ones over here. Uh, stuck. See? Over here. So you can just walk across. Like, and the fact that they added this whole back area that adds a shit ton new stuff. And then there's this necromancer the uh, section complete with purple flames and like dead nobles and stuff. It's not just an oval like it was before. It's like a weird zigzag type thing yeah. at the end, which is awesome. But I like Bruma because when it, when you first come into town and it's nighttime, here I'll show you. You're just like, oh holy fuck! It looks so good. I uh, this is animated uh, interior lighting. Like I have the chimneys and stuff, but wait. So this is what you'll see when you first come in Jibruma. Let me say real quick, it's notorious for crashing on weights. We'll wait until... Roof shelves. And... No way. Wait for it. Yeah! Look at that fucking shit! Bruma looks so pretty! Like, I don't know, the... Oh. Oh, it's you. I can definitely tell the difference. It, when it gets to be nighttime, the way that the cathedral is lit up is fantastic. When you come out to the top areas and you can see, like, the chimneys just poofing out their smoke and the cathedral, it's pretty. It's pretty. Get out of here before you uh, the only place that's prettier than this is the Arcane oh. University, and that, god damn it, that, they did, that's probably the best thing that they did. They're, they even added different sound effects and a bunch of other shit, it's fantastic. Alright, so just a, just a glimpse, this, this is the outside, and it's nighttime, so you can't see shit. That's really ominous and foreboding. And it just gets better once you get inside. <clears throat> Pooping out their smoke. Pooping it out. <clears throat> Such detail. And this is inside the university. You can hear, like, the magical properties going off. I like Act your sword, by the way. Is actually, like, spewing out flames. Spewing them out. And the, the rest of it looks pretty good, too. But I can't get back there. I can't get back out there. Uh, what is Oblivion's main story quest that I've only ever played once? Uh, you have to find Martin, which is the only remaining septum, so that he can defeat Mehrun Dagon. So, that's it. This is not vanilla. No, sir. This is or lady. It might be a lady. Freaking, this is, uh, this is extremely <laughs> heavily modded. If you put in exclamation point mods in my chat, you will be, it'll send you a link to a, uh, a master 
page that'll give you all of the mods, or all of the games that I have mods for, and all of the mods that I have installed for all of them. But yeah, no, this is, this is, this, this is not vanilla. It's extremely heavily modded. <clears throat> Too much, too much magic stuffs. Have you seen the inside of Imperial City? Ow. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, you're good. All right, it's meeting time. This is matter of the ass, son. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's a little bit. It's a little bit. It probably crashed. No, it didn't. Good. And Oblivion's like the hardest one to mod. Sweet. Because you have to make old mods, and you have to use Oblivion Mod Manager, and not the Nexus Mod Manager, and it's nighttime, so you can't see shit. <clears throat> Wait for daytime. Like, Imperial City is one, one place that everyone knows exactly what it looks like, so this is a good place to start at for, for how different, uh, better cities makes it. I mean, obviously these trees are here that aren't usually there, and that's, that's the first thing. So you walk into Imperial City, into the marketplace from here. You're just like, oh look. Let's get rid of this torch. Torch. You walk in, you look both ways, and you're like, oh look, everything looks pretty much the same. And then you're just like, what the fuck How is this? Been you look over here and you're like, oh my god, there's a staircase. You walk up the staircase. <laughs> I love what they do with Imperial City. So there's a store here. There's a store here. There's one down that way and around the corner. There's one here. There's one here and here. Some of them don't have signs, so keep that in mind. And this is one of the coolest stores that I've seen the Better Cities ads. And every time I come in here, I'm so happy. Look at it. It's a fucking toy store. Complete with, like, little wooden horses and like yeah and I always knock over the castle because I'm fucking huge I I'm very very tall like everyone has to look <laughs> up at me I'm a very tall lady I'm a very big 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 lady big lady Freaking so I knock over shit it doesn't help that I have wings too so yeah there's another store here and then this is the particle effects I was talking about earlier when you guys were talking about 2d particle effects in a 3d game and then... That's interesting, the second level to the stores. Yeah. They took out yeah. the That's statues. Bad. So if you have any mods that adds like stuff to wait, where's Pim? Pim's back at the house. Uh I was doing the Thieves Guild in the Dark Brotherhood, which means lots of sneaking around. And fuck, I cannot sneak with her. Okay. And there went the castle. Yeah. <laughs> And then there's like stores back here too, like all the way down. Uh, there's a what do they call it? Um, public bathhouse, I think. Juno's guest house, yeah. Juno. I'm sorry, I can't hear the name Juno without thinking of Beetlejuice. And Juno, your case worker. Like, uh, maybe it's just me. I have to say that I like the particle effects. You don't like them, or you do like them? No, I do like them. Oh, okay, I was gonna say. Any good books lately? Glues the toys down. I know it's glued down. It doesn't matter. It's a scripted thing, so if I go back in there, they'll all be put back together. I've knocked those over a million times. A million times. Ah, uh, Leowin is fucking awesome. Let me show you guys Leowin real quick. Leowin's pretty sweet. Pretty fucking sweet. Yeah, there's a uh, place in Skyrim I go that it's like the scripted mm -hmm. thing, and I like just like. Shouting and making all the uh, clutter just all over the place. Just and everywhere. <laughs> exiting and going back in and doing it over again. Oh, I found out she's not mute. She only has a uh, voice for um, for battle. So she thinks she says stuff when she's in a fight, but only when she's in a fight. And then she doesn't. She doesn't have any. Cause the person that made her did the voice cues for her. And they guess they didn't fucking record. Hello, Spider-Man. They didn't record anything for out of combat. So there's only combat. Um, and I guess she talks a lot of shit. I just... I haven't had her. She usually dies. Alright, but the reason why Leowin's so fucking awesome is they extended the flooding like crazy. There is flooding everywhere in Leowin now. 
everywhere. I thought this was cool as hell. Look! There's flooding everywhere. Wait, I don't know. Considering this is right outside of elsewhere, Korean, it should be marshy. It should be like this. Like, if you look at the map, it's right next to freaking, or it's right next to Ellsware and Black Marsh, which means this is supposed to be like the most flooded areas of all of the maps. It's supposed to look like this. Like for once, yeah. I was like, holy shit, they did a fucking good job. <laughs> Wait, up on, is it roof? I know I can jump up higher than this. Fine, fuck you. <laughs> Damn, that's a lot yes, of flooding. Hello, ID. How are you doing? How's your job been? Selective speaking. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. The nerd roots fucking regrew. That means that tonight, after the stream's done, I'm gonna be running all up and down the coastline again to get all those Hi nerd there. roots. Good morning. <laughs> Call me crazy, but you didn't like. Oh, really? Really? I, I don't know. I definitely like Oblivion way better than I like Skyrim, and then Morrowind even more than that. Even, even more than that. The sun. <laughs>